and more clocks by paint hunches. One day, Mr. Huggins found a clock in the attic. It looked very spitted. Standing there, standing, standing there. How do I know it is correct? He thought. So he went out and bought another, which he placed in the bedroom. Three o'clock," said Mister Higgins. "I'll see if the other clock is right." He ran up to the attic, but the clock said one minute past three. How do I know which one is right? He thought. So he went out and bought another, which he placed in the kitchen. Ten minutes to four. I'll check the others. He ran up to the attic. The attic clock said. Eight minutes to four. He ran down to the bedroom. The bedroom clock said seven minutes to four. I still don't know which one is right. He thought. So he went out and bought another, which he placed in the hall. Twenty minutes past four. He said. And ran up to the attic. The attic clock said twenty-three minutes past four. He ran down to the kitchen. The kitchen clock said twenty-five minutes past four. He ran up to the bedroom. The bedroom clock said twenty-six minutes past four. This is no good at all, thought Mrs. Hagen. And he went to the clockmaker. My hall clock says twenty minutes past four. My attic clock says twenty-three minutes past four. My kitchen clock says twenty-five minutes past four. My bedroom clock says twenty-six many minutes past four. And I don't know which one is right," said Mister Huggins. So the clockmaker went to the house to look at the clocks. The hall clock said five o'clock. There's nothing wrong with this clock," said the clockmaker. "Look." The kitchen clock said one minute past five. "There!" shouted Mister Huggins. "You watch," said five o'clock. But it is one minute past now," said the clockmaker. "Look." The bedroom clock said two minutes past five. "Absolutely correct," said the clockmaker. "Look." The attic clock said three minutes past five. "There's nothing wrong with this clock either." Said the clockmaker. Look, what a wonderful watch! Said Mister Huggins, and he went out and bought a one. And since he bought his watch, all his clock has been right. The end.